on Showtime Extreme that the uh, public can watch is a fight that is very, very exciting. Uh, on paper, it looks great. Live is gonna be even better. You have a fighter by the name of Tomoki Kemeda, who is 29 and 0, 18 knockouts out of Tokyo, Japan. Now he's facing Bumlan Sing Singai. Sorry if I mispronounced it. <laughs> He has a record of 46 and two with 31 knockouts out of Bangkok, Thailand. And that'll be a 12 round WBO Bantamweight uh, world title. And that's one fight uh, that we all, we all wanna tune in. That's the appetizer for the, uh, for the main course live on Showtime, a pay-per-view. One more fighter that we're really excited about promoting under the Golden Boy banner is 2012 Brazilian Olympic bronze medalist Yamaguchi Falcoa with a record of 1-0. Uh, he's out of Sao Paulo, uh, Brazil. He's going up against uh, Jesus Cruz uh, with a record of 1-1 one one, uh, with one knockout. Uh, he's, he's out of Arecibo, Puerto Rico. That'll be a six-rounder in the middleweight division. Uh, Yamaguchi is a fighter who is uh, decorated with amateur titles and golden gloves and national titles. So with heart punching, a uh, slick fighter, uh, with that determination of one day being, being great. So we're, we're really excited to be uh, showcasing and uh, uh, featuring on these undercards uh, two middleweights that the fight fans should uh, definitely uh, um, uh, follow. And let me tell you one thing, putting this card together, along with my matchmaker Eric Gomez and Robert Diaz and Team Canelo and Team Lara, uh, along with Abner and, and everybody involved here, I have to admit, I took out a page uh, out of uh, Dana White's book with stacking the cards from top to bottom making sure that the fans, uh, not only at home, but inside the arena, are getting there early to watch exciting uh, champions of tomorrow, the champions of present, of today. Making sure that they get there early and watch these terrific, terrific fights. Hello, everyone. Um, just wanna say I'm real happy to be fighting a big car like this under Canelo. Um, you know, I had a big fight with Danny Garcia. Uh, and, and that's what got me here. Um, the people wanted to see me back, and they put me with another tough guy. Joan Perez is not an easy fight. Um, but we come well prepared, and we want to show everybody who Mauricio Herrera is. And uh, what better than on a big car, Canelo, and all these great fighters here. They're going to put on, uh, put their life on the line tomorrow and to entertain you guys. And I um, just want to say thank you. Thank you for everybody coming out. Thank Golden Boy for the opportunity. And um, I'll give you guys a great show. I hope everybody here does too. Thank you guys. Oh, buenas, buenas tardes. Good afternoon, everyone. Pero quiero dar las gracias a Golden Boy Promotion por hacerme parte de esta cartelera tan importante. Canelo Lara. I want to thank Golden Boy Promotion for the opportunity. Venimos, venimos preparados, venimos a hacer nuestro trabajo. Venimos bien preparados y bueno, da un buen espectáculo para para el público que que él que se lo merece. Y gracias. I'm well prepared. I trained hard for this fight to give the public what they want to see a great fight. Thank you. Buenas tardes a todos. Eh, pues estoy muy contento por estar en esta cartelera con grandes peleadores. Eh, Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, what can I say? I'm very happy to be here in this great card with all these great fighters. Eh, eso me motiva a dar una gran pelea, un gran espectáculo. It motivates me to put, a, put on a good fight, a good show, and uh, make everyone happy. Eh, hice una gran preparación en la Ciudad de México, y pues estamos listos para brindarles una gran pelea. I had a great training camp in, uh, in Mexico City, y and I'm prepared to give everybody a great fight. Y estoy muy agradecido con Oscar, con Golden Boy, y con Showtime por la oportunidad. I want to thank Oscar, Golden Boy Promotions, Showtime for this great opportunity. Y pues 
Vamos a echarle muchas ganas y les voy a dar una gran pelea. I'm going to give it my all and give you guys a great fight. For his determination, for his pride, for his honor, representing Puerto Rico. When you have two fighters, one from Mexico, one from Puerto Rico, guaranteed fireworks. The tradition of those rivalries in boxing are bar none the best in any sport. We've, we've witnessed, witnessed it in boxing history, uh, whether it's Rosario, whether it's Felix Trinidad, uh, whether it's uh, the best of the best, Hector Macho Camacho, Gomez, on one side, and then on another side, you've had the likes of Julio Cesar Chavez, you've had uh, the greats like Pepino Cuevas, uh, Raton Macias, You've had the best of the best uh, coming from Mexico, wow. like Saul Canelo Alvarez now, writing his own history. When you put those fighters in that same ring, you're gonna get a war, that's for sure. So this next fighter hailing out of Rio Piedras, Puerto Rico. He's the former WBO featherweight and junior featherweight world champion. Coming off a tremendous, tremendous victory over Ponce de Leon. Let me introduce to you the Rio Piedras, Puerto Rico, Juan Manuel Lopez. Good afternoon, everyone. Primero que nada, quiero darle gracias a Dios por una vez más estar en un gran escenario como este. I want to get, uh, give thanks to God for being in this position in a, at a big stage again. A todos los medios de prensa, a Golden Boy, a Showtime, muchas gracias por la oportunidad. All the press here, Golden Boy Promotions, Showtime, thank you for this opportunity. La cuarta vez que vengo a Las Vegas a pelear, este, tres ocasiones anteriores ganó las tres por nocaut, esperamos pues seguir con el mismo récord. This is the fourth time I come to Las Vegas to fight. Uh, the prior three times I've, I've won by knockout, and I hope to continue that. Es una gran pelea, una gran oportunidad para mí. No la voy a desaprovechar, así que vengo a darle todo por el todo. This is a great opportunity for me, and I'm looking to take full advantage. So I'm going to give it my all. Así que los saludos que vean la cartelera va a ser un gran cartel y sobre todo que vean mi pelea que voy a tener una gran victoria. And I'm on a great card with all these great fighters, and I'm here to give you guys a great victory. Thank you. Pascal. Primero que nada, dale gracias a Dios. First, first of all, I want to thank God for tenerme aquí. Gracias a la prensa que sin usted no somos nadie. Thank you for the press, all of you here. Without you guys, we wouldn't be anybody. El show time por darme la oportunidad a a a con el promotion junto a Puerto Rico de Box y mi compañía. Uh, uh, Showtime for giving me this opportunity. Golden Boy Promotions, PR Best Boxing, thank you. Para no abundar mucho, vengo bien preparado eh, eh, a dar una buena pelea. I won't say too many things, but uh, I'm very well prepared to give uh, everyone a good fight. Sabemos la, la gran calidad de boxeador que es en el mare y, y, y me preparé para él. We know the great fighter that Abner Mares is, and I prepared for him. Pienso que Puerto Rico y, y México dan grandes peleas. Esta no va a ser la última. And we know that uh, Puerto Rico versus Mexico always puts up good fights and uh, this won't be an exception. Pues solo que queda es que llegue el día de la pelea eh, para que vean a un Jonathan Ocendo eh, eh, engrandecido. And uh, all we're doing now is just waiting for the fight time. You know, so you guys can see the best Jonathan Ocendo possible que me preparé para, para dar el máximo, dar este, gracias a, a mi entrenador, eh, Denis Pantoja, que siempre estaba ahí conmigo. And I prepared very well to give my maximum uh, effort, and I want to thank my trainer, Danny Pantojas, uh, for getting the best out of me. A mi manejador Orlando Piñero por confiar en mí, en que sí podemos, y, yeah. y, my manager, y que una gran Piñero. Gracias. And thank you very much, thank you. Muy buenas tardes a todos. Eh, son 11 meses, Oscar, no un año. <laughs> Good afternoon, everybody. Oscar, it's, it's been 11 months, not a year. Um, ¿Qué les puedo decir? Eh, estoy muy emocionado de estar de regreso. Eh, como 
acabo de decir, son 11 meses que he estado ausente de este deporte que, que me ha dado todo. Estoy what, muy emocionado. What can I say? I'm very excited to be back. It's been 11 months uh, in a sport that I love and it's given me everything. Vengo con más ganas, con más hambre de seguir adelante. He sido tres veces campeón mundial y voy por muchos más. I'm very hungry. I'm very hungry to return and uh, I was I've been a three-time world champion and I want more. I want to be champion and more. Tengo 28 años. Este es mi año. Me falta muchísimo más que dar. Esto va por México. Gracias a Oscar de la Hoya, a Showtime por ponerme en esta grande cartelera. I'm only 28 years old and, and very determined and uh, I want to dedicate this fight to Mexico and uh, I want to thank Oscar, Golden Boy Promotions, Showtime. Eh, Jonathan Oquendo, yo sé que viene con ganas, viene con hambre, es un muchacho joven. Eh, sabe, sabe el que el ganarme a mí lo pondría en una posición muy alta, pero si él viene con hambre eh, de una semana, yo vengo con hambre de todo un año. And uh, what can I say, Jonathan Oquendo's a determined fighter, he's a young fighter, I know that he's coming very hungry, but you know, if he's hungry for about a week, I've been hungry for 11 months, almost a year. Gracias a todos. No se pierdan mi pelea. Abner Mares está de regreso y esto es por Jalisco. Gracias. Thank you very much and uh, don't miss my fight. How's everyone doing today? Um, first, I'd like to thank God. I'd like to thank all the media and all the fans uh, for coming out. And um, I thank Mr. Bennett from the Las Vegas uh, Commission, Mr. Stern from MGM, our advisor Al Heyman for uh, you know making this happen, Golden Boy, Oscar, Eric, Robert, uh, the whole crew, and uh, Team Canelo for uh, accepting the challenge to fight the best 154 pound in the world. And um, we're excited, and uh, you guys are going to see a great, great fight on, on Saturday night. And the American dreamer is Landy Laura. He's going to win this one. There's no question to prove he's the best 154 pound in the world. Thank you guys, and have a great day. First off, I just want to thank my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I want to thank Golden Boy, Showtime. Um, obviously, Al Heyman. This wouldn't be possible without him. We had a tremendous camp. Canelo is a great fighter. But on Saturday night, Ayers Landelar is going to prove he's the best 154 pounder in the world, bar none. Thank you. From Team Lara, he's a young man that we've known over the years, who has trained some of the very best fighters in the world. He is Ronnie Shields. Ronnie. Ronnie's currently not here. He's with our other world champion, Rancis Barthelemy, um, fighting tonight on Fox Sports. And uh, I think Ronnie said enough. He's got to say on all axes, and everyone knows <laughs> his opinion. So uh, that's speaking for Ronnie. Thank you, guys. So the young man that I'll be introducing to you next is a very confident fighter who graduated from the renowned Cuban amateur boxing program and migrated here to the U.S. in the pursuit of, of his professional career. He uh, suffered a controversial decision loss to Paul Williams in 2011. Since, since then, he's been the likes of Ronald Hearns and Alfredo Angulo. He won the WBA Junior Middleweight World Championship, defeating Angulo. And recently, he's coming off a decision win against Austin Trout in December of 2013. He's obviously looking to steal the show. He's a confident young man, a fighter that believes in, in his abilities. He even said that he's gonna smack me across the head. I mean, that's how, wow, what great confidence, huh? I'm not gonna hit back, obviously. I, I retired for five years, but that's the confidence that he has. This is a real fight, folks. This is a real fight with two real fighters. And come Saturday night, you're not getting one fighter that is great, you know, and, 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 and a fighter that is here just to, uh, to lay down or a fighter here to, uh, yeah, thank you for the opportunity. No, he's here to win. And it doesn't get any better than this. That's why this fight here, Saturday, live on Showtime pay-per-view, 
uh, is going to be one for the ages. With a record of 19 and 1, 12 knockouts de Guantanamo, Cuba, Erislandi Lara. Eh, buenas tardes a todos. Good afternoon, everyone. Eh, quiero darle las gracias a toda la gente de la prensa, a toda la gente de la cámara. I want to thank everybody here, the press. Thank you for being here. A Showtime, a MGM, a Golden Boy. Showtime, MGM, Golden Boy. Eh, Team Lara, por, por esta oportunidad. Team Lara, for helping me get this opportunity. Estamos ready, estamos ready. No, ya creo que no hay más nada que hablar, ya todo se ha hablado. We're ready, we're ready. I think there's nothing much more to say. I've said what I had to say. Hoy quiero darle las gracias a los Charlos por estar aquí, que es un, es un compañero de, de, de campo. Charlos. Oh, oh, I want to thank the Charlos that are here. Uh, they've helped me out, prepared me for this fight. Y listo, nos vemos el 12 de julio. And I'm ready, I'm ready. Uh, we'll see everybody on Saturday, July 12th. Gracias a todos. Thank you all. ¿Qué tal? Muy buenas tardes a todos ustedes. How are you guys doing? Good afternoon, everyone. Bueno, agradecerles a todos y cada uno de ustedes eh, su asistencia a esta conferencia final para la gran, gran función del próximo sábado 12 de julio. I want to tell you guys that I appreciate all you uh, attending this final press conference for this great fight Saturday, July 12th. Bueno, y recordando una canción del enorme, gran compositor mexicano que se llama José Alfredo Jiménez, que dice, si acabaron las palabras, ahora sí hay que hablar, pero hablar con los puños arriba del ring. And I just want to repeat a, a poem from a great uh, composer, Mexican composer, José Alfredo Jiménez, that says, uh, the time for words is over, now it's time to fight with our fist up in the ring. Hey, campanero, suena la campana, que empiece la pelea, porque Canelo y su equipo está listo, listo para ganar. Gracias. <laughs> eh, buenas tardes a todos. Good afternoon, everyone. Eh, pues, como dice mi papá, pues ya no, no hay nada que decir, la verdad. Hicimos un, una gran preparación. Like my dad says, there's really nothing more to say. We, we had a great preparation. Tenemos un gran peleador. We have a great fighter. Eh, con grandes cualidades que puede pelear en el terreno que, que sea. With uh, great qualities, it can fight pretty much any style. Y él está listo para pelear el día 12 y demostrar que, pues, que en las 154 libras él, él es el que manda. And uh, he's ready to fight on Saturday night, July 12th, and uh, to prove that Otra vez, gracias. he's the main guy. Otra vez gracias a todos y pues que Dios bendiga a todos los que están en la cartelera, que todos salgan con bien y... Y va a ser una gran función. Gracias. Once again, thank you all for being here and uh, God bless everybody. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 